Hey guys, welcome back to the 24 Days of Christmas. I would normally do Rob Vice, but they're far behind. So, in, play, in lieu of that, I'm going to be doing something, something that got me for my birthday. It's going to be Doctor Who Avid Calendar. I'm going to finish this one up on here, even if Rob Vice is one come in on time. Uh, later on, not on time. But I just wanted to do a quick review of it and do a day one opening. I almost threw this away, not realizing it was day 19 over here. So I'll leave it here. My place is currently a mess. So ignore the mess. And if you see anything. And one thing I would really, really like to mention to everyone. This is the greatest idea ever. Avid calendar for anything. I completely encourage. But one thing I so, so wholeheartedly discourage. Is showing what you're going to get. This is the dumbest thing you could do. It's supposed to be a surprise. I don't care about what I'm going to get. I got it for the countdown and for the surprise. I honestly, I haven't looked at this properly. Don't plan on to. But yeah, I don't want to know what's in any of these boxes. I want to open them and be surprised. Pleasantly surprised. Why? Because I bought the Avid Calendar because I liked it. So in this case, I love Doctor Who. They bought me an Avid Calendar for my birthday to open. And I don't care what comes in it. I'm a Doctor Who fan. I'm a Hooven. Let's go. All in no fear on this. But yeah. Rob Vice, same situation. Love their products. First year, almost spot on. First year, almost spot on. Second year, off to a bang. And their Avid Calendar. Shipping is a bit behind, but, but completely understandable since they are everyone is short staff around the world and everything. So I'll give it a pass. But yeah. Sorry about that rant on the Avid Calendar situation and whatnot. But yeah, I will do a Rob Vice Avid Calendar opening once it arrives. I'll do all the days up to the day it is. So if it's... Five days late, I'll open one through five to keep, get caught up, and I'll continue one by one after that. But all right, let's get right to it. It is, let's get back to it, not right to it. Day one, what do we get, and how do we open this? Oh, they're actual boxes. See, this design is immaculate. This is amazing. It's like a little jigsaw puzzle. Nothing's going to fall. Maybe if I take out 24, the rest will fall, but that's why it's the last one. See? Ingenious. I take this one out before this one. I'm assuming this one to fall. Experiment time. Wait. Experiment time number. If I take number nine out, would number eight fall? It would. Shit. 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 All right. Excuse me, guys. There we go. But yeah. No. This is awesome. Day one. Box one. Let's see. Yeah. No. Let's not show that on camera. So that place is a mess right now. I haven't had a chance to clean with all the shopping going on and whatnot. And, ooh, heavy. This is awesome. This is like 24 mini presents. Whoever designed this did a, a immaculate job. Let me see this because, yeah, um, I think they're right there. This one. These guys did an amazing job. The items, we'll see. And day one. Ah, uh, yeah. A Dalek. 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 For the people that like to be fancy, Darlick for everyone else. Bottle opener. I'm actually going to get a lot of use out of this. So let me set this little guy right there. And let's see here. One. No bottle. No. Bottle cap. Can't stand against the Emperor of the Darlicks. Bottle opener. Famous for its iconic spherical head. The Emperor appeared in Remnants of the Darlicks in 1988 and recently in Time Lord's victorious multi-platform event in 2020 2021 huh time lord victorious that dude this is actually amazing like legitimately amazing this is the coolest i've only opened a few the uh, i'm opening one two two right now this will be my third one i opened today i've opened two in the past but this is the coolest avid calendar i have opened yet I might have to look into opening more stuff from these guys. They are amazing. Little fun fact, little FF for everyone. The item, the design, it's just awesome. Like the packaging is still great. It's simple. This is awesome. Guys, if you guys are looking for any kind of mini gifts, I would check them out. I'm about to start checking them out a lot more. Hero collectors. I don't think there's anything else. Like you guys can do that. I'm going to do a quick glance, but I'm just looking down here try to see if there's anything else but no it's there hero collector hero collectors.com definitely check them out not even close to sponsored by them i wish my 
gosh, this thing's awesome so far. Design, 10 out of 10. Gifts, so far, 10 out of 10. Packaging, 10 out of 10. This whole thing was amazing. But yeah, that's only day one. I can't wait for where's day two. I always, there it is, day two. I cannot wait to open that tomorrow. But yeah, that's it for now, guys. Um, keep, stay tuned. Uh, we'll go through one, two, three, four. We'll go through all 24. And hopefully we get something amazing in each one. And maybe my reaction will be the same. Maybe it won't. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Till next time. See ya.